Aeromobile 5.0 VTOL flying car. The Slovakian firm Aeromobile came up with a novel idea with its 5.0 VTOL program. It is a door-to-door -door flying automobile that seats four people and is powered by electricity. The vehicle's propulsion system consists of a pusher propeller situated at the back for horizontal thrust and two electrically driven propellers on the tips of the wings for vertical takeoff and landing. Once in driving configuration, the wings will pivot backward. The Aeromobile 5.0 has safety measures such as airbags and a full aircraft parachute, and it can supposedly fly 435 miles. Upon arrival in a location, users have the choice of driving or taking a flight, making it ideal for travel both within and between cities. With the 5.0, the corporation hopes to achieve fully autonomous flight. Personal air travel is going to be a whole lot better in the future because to this idea. Supernal SA2 A division of Hyundai Motor Group is developing the SA2 electric vertical takeoff and landing vehicle. Commercial intracity passenger journeys using this system are scheduled to begin in 2028. A distinctive feature of the SA2 is the combination of vertical and horizontal thrust produced by its eight swiveling rotors. It can reach speeds of over 120 miles per hour at an elevation of 1,500 feet, making short work of 25 to 40 miles on a typical city journey. The aircraft satisfies all international safety regulations because it was built with safety in mind. Modular and customizable, its cabin can be quickly and simply transformed into a cargo, two or four passenger configuration, thanks to the work of acclaimed designers of high-end automobiles. The SA2 is an important development in the field of advanced air mobility, which seeks to offer a sustainable, efficient, and safe means of transportation. Nalwa 5X EVTOL Aircraft Nalwa Aero debuted their first electric vertical takeoff and landing aircraft, the Nalwa 5X, in India. It seats five people. Its four passengers and their bags, plus the pilot, make it ideal for long flights in the sky. This aircraft has the capability to be operated remotely or autonomously, and it can also be set up to carry cargo in the air. A maximum cruise speed of 400 kilometers per hour and a flying time of 1.5 hours with a 15-minute reserve are some of its impressive features. A total of 12 electric motors drive the Nalwa 5X's 12 tilt electric ducted fans. Its design ensures unmatched stability and control, especially in the face of difficult wind conditions. From transporting passengers to delivering freight, the interior configurations are highly versatile and can be easily assembled to suit a variety of jobs. A number of essential subsystems on board the plane are redundant as well. Audis Aviation EVTOL Creating a hybrid electric vertical takeoff and landing aircraft that can travel great distances quickly is a top priority for Audis Aviation, a pioneer in the aerospace sector. By drastically cutting flight times on the busiest routes in the globe, this plane is set to change the face of air travel forever. With its hybrid electric propulsion system, which integrates the advantages of both traditional gas turbines and all-electric batteries VTOL, this environmentally friendly aircraft can reach speeds of 345 miles per hour, carry up to nine passengers and two pilots, and have an electric range of 200 miles. Its overall range is 750 miles. Expanding flight paths and lowering hub and spoke constraints, the plane may land and take off on conventional runways as well as vertiports and helipads. Passengers and operators alike can anticipate revolutionary advantages from this cutting-edge technology. Vertical Aerospace VA-2X, an electric vertical takeoff and landing aircraft that was developed specifically for urban transportation, the Vertical Aerospace VA-2X, sometimes referred to as the VX-4, is a pioneering aircraft. It is completely electric, environmentally friendly and convenient. The VX-4 is supposed to have a range of up to 100 miles and a cruise speed of up to 150 miles per hour. Its goal is to cut travel times down to minutes by utilizing a vertical takeoff and landing system that is nimble. The airplane has the capacity to transport payload weighing up to 250 kilograms. 
On August 22nd, it successfully accomplished its first flight at Landbetter Airfield, which is located in Wales. The VX-4 was developed to conform to high safety standards, which are comparable to those that are required of commercial carriers that transport passengers. This aircraft is going to completely change the way that airport transfers and regional flights are conducted. Vision VTOL Quadcopter a prototype electric quadcopter designed by the Waters Trust, the Vision VTOL quadcopter is capable of vertical takeoff and landing. Offering unparalleled safety and elegance, it is built for ultra-long-range electric power and storage, providing point-to-point -point transit. The design incorporates a sailplane cockpit and fuselage to enhance aerodynamics, but omitting control surfaces. It has eight electric motors, four of which shift the rotor ducts from the climb and descent mode to the flight mode, and two for each set of propellers. With its scalability, the Vision VTOL may be configured to carry four or six passengers. It could have a four-hour runtime because it is built to function at a density four times that of present-day lithium polymer batteries. The group is aiming to improve battery technology so that it can store more energy for 30 times as long with 30 times the current density. Rolls-Royce EVTOL concept. The EVTOL idea by Rolls-Royce is a hybrid electric vehicle that was created for a variety of purposes, including personal transportation, public transportation, logistics, and military transportation responsibilities. A low noise profile is achieved through the utilization of gas turbine technology, which is used to generate electricity and operate six electric propellers. Approximately 500 miles may be traveled at speeds of up to 250 miles per hour while the vehicle can accommodate four or five passengers. For vertical takeoff and landing, the wings can rotate through a full 90 degrees. And when the aircraft is at cruise height, the propellers on the wings fold away to lessen the amount of drag and noise in the cabin. This novel idea has the potential to revolutionize personal travel, expedite supply chains, and contribute to the development of communities that are more environmentally friendly. Nazeni Evtol Aircraft An idea for an airplane developed in Armenia is the Nazeni Evtol. There are 36 EDF engines that power this five-seater plane. There has a top speed of 295 kilometers per hour for this plane. Up to 1,400 kilograms is the maximum takeoff weight. In its maximum flying time of 70 minutes, the plane can travel 350 kilometers. Up to 500 kilograms is the maximum payload it can handle. A height of 2,500 meters is the utmost that the plane can handle. It takes around 45 minutes for the battery to charge. Aircraft construction utilizing carbon fiber for the primary structure and EDF engines allows for utmost efficiency in flight. Excellent speed, excellent maneuverability, and long distance capabilities are all offered by this little design. Unmanned aerial vehicles are capable of running entirely autonomously. On the subject of urban air mobility, the Nazeni EVTOL concept holds promise. Kelikona's Colossal. The New York City firm Kelikona is planning a massive electric vertical takeoff and landing plane that can carry 40 people. This daring plane can travel fast between cities and can accommodate 40 people. Every part of the plane works together to create lift. Unlike any other plane, its fuselage is unusually oblong and narrows towards the back. In order to achieve vertical takeoff, the plane makes use of four sets of two huge ducted fans equipped with variable pitch blades. According to its claims, it can cover the 330 miles between Los Angeles and San Francisco in under an hour. A massive detachable battery pack with 3.6 megawatt hours of power powers the plane. Thanks to the aircraft's removable battery pack, it may continue to its next location, even as the battery is being recharged. As far as public transit strategies go, this fresh take on EVTOL design is unprecedented. NASA's X-59 Quiet Supersonic Lockheed Martin's Skunk Works is responsible for the development of the X-59 Quiet Supersonic technology, which is an experimental supersonic aircraft. This aircraft was built for the low-boom flight demonstrator project by NASA. 
The X59 is designed to travel at speeds greater than the speed of sound, while simultaneously reducing the ordinarily tremendous sonic boom to a very quiet thump of sound. By paving the way for commercial airplanes that are capable of traveling faster than sound, this one-of-a-kind aircraft intends to transform the way that air travel is conducted. The X-59 is anticipated to travel at a speed that is 1.4 times faster than the speed of sound, which is equivalent to 925 miles per hour, while producing a sonic thud that is less audible. In order to collect information about how people perceive the sound that the X-59 produces, NASA intends to fly it over a number of different areas. Rolls-Royce Axel The Rolls-Royce Axel functions as a demonstration aircraft for electric aviation. This is a step in Rolls-Royce's path to achieve net-zero carbon emissions by the year 2050. The Axel project has the objective of constructing the world's fastest all-electric airplane that has ever been seen. There are three axial flux motors and a 750 volt, 216 kilowatt hour battery with 6,480 cells that are responsible for the powering of the aircraft, which is known as Spirit of Innovation. On September 15th, 2021, it successfully completed its first flight, hitting a maximum speed of 622 kilometers per hour and maintaining a speed of 560 kilometers per hour over a distance of three kilometers. In January of 2022, the Fédération Aéronautique Internationale recognized these speeds as being exceptional enough to be considered world records for electric aircraft. Participants in the project include Yasa Limited and Electro Flight. Sky OV Oscar Vinales, a designer from in Barcelona, came up with the idea for a supersonic plane called the Sky OV. With its unique design, this aircraft is set to transform the aviation industry by prioritizing speed, efficiency, and sustainability. The Sky OV is able to reach incredible speeds while reducing fuel consumption because to its cutting edge engine technology. It's environmentally conscious because it uses hydrogen fuel and electricity to power itself. Four aerodynamic wings fold up to save hangar space when not in use, contributing to the design's streamlined fighter jet appearance. An innovative fluidic propulsion air multiplier system and bladeless turbojet technology are utilized by the engines. The predicted top speed for the Sky OV is 1,141 miles per hour, with a cruise speed of 913 miles per hour. With room for up to 200 people, it guarantees a high level of comfort and luxury. You could think of this idea as a... EVE Air Mobility. Embraer is a prominent aircraft manufacturer, and EVE Air Mobility is one of its subsidiaries. EVE is a company that was founded in 2020 with the goal of creating electric vertical takeoff and landing planes and other infrastructure to revolutionize urban air mobility. EVE's eVTOL is an all-electric vehicle that prioritizes passenger convenience, accessibility, and safety. There will likely be a pilot on board during the launch, but it will be prepared for autonomous operations in the future. EVE is developing solutions for the full UAM ecosystem, including services, operations, and air traffic control, in addition to developing eVTOL. Air mobility should be accessible and inexpensive for everyone, and the company's goals include reducing travel time, and preventing CO2 emissions. In EVE's future, air travel is the new ground traffic, a stress-free, efficient, and environmentally friendly alternative. Stratolaunch Talon A. The Stratolaunch Talon A is a hypersonic aircraft vehicle that was designed to be reusable and powered by rockets. Within the range of 3,800 to 5,300 miles per hour, it is designed to fly. The length of the airplane is 8.5 meters, and its wingspan is precisely 3.4 meters. The Talon A is supposed to be entirely recoverable and reusable, in contrast to its predecessor, the Talon A TA-1, which was an aircraft that was only used once. It is able to land on a runway and then take off again, which streamlines the process of accessing the hypersonic flying environment and makes it more cheap. The Talon A is a component of Strato Launch's one-of-a-kind air launch system, which employs the largest airplane in the world as a transportable launch platform in order to launch high-speed vehicles into the hypersonic environment. 
Increasing the reliability and consistency of flight testing is the objective here. Airbus Maverick. One such unmanned aircraft system is the Airbus Maverick, which is undergoing testing at the moment. At under 2 meters in length and 3.2 meters in width, it serves as a miniature model of a remote-controlled aircraft. A spacious cabin layout is one way the design differs from conventional airplane architecture. Flying more sustainably may be possible thanks to this novel design, which has the potential to cut fuel usage by as much as 20%. Launched in 2017, the Maverick project finally saw its demonstrator take to the skies in June 2019. At the 2020 Singapore Air Show, the news was unveiled to the public. According to Airbus, the Maverick's hybrid wing body design has the potential to revolutionize environmental performance. Additionally, this layout paves the way for novel propulsion technologies and an adaptable interior, all of which contribute to an exceptional experience for passengers.